I mean, our airplanes are all fastened together, one panel at a time overlapping other panels. When one part breaks, there's a chance that it could affect the parts around it. Something else is now picking up the stress or the load that that part was carrying beforehand. We had an individual in our shop who had found this laser dent scanner online, which seemed kind of far-fetched. It seemed very science fiction. We place these location sensors, they're just little stickers. You can stick them anywhere you want, and it'll use those to pinpoint where you're moving the laser around on your part. And then it'll then, you'll define your surfaces, and in moments it'll tell you all the deviations within that surface. So originally the way that we were measuring aircraft damage, dents and delaminations and such, uh, we would actually go out there and physically with a tape measure or a six inch scale, we would measure the size of the dent and then we'd take a pit depth gauge which would measure down the depth. And that's the archaic way of doing it now, I would say. Uh, in addition to that, because we have the internet nowadays, uh, I could actually save this to a shared drive location and it could be used at joint bases other bases can scan parts, so for instance, if we have a C5 or something broken in Japan, uh, we could get a scan of a part from out here, print it and ship it out there without actually having to send somebody to measure that part individually.